Yo, 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 what up, what up? What's going on? What's going on? How y'all doing? I ain't gonna even let it run too long. We're gonna jump on in here so we can get to it. What's up, everybody? What's going on? Oh, let me let me do the intro. What's up, everybody? Charles Macro jumping back in the fishing planet. Hope everybody's doing well. Shout out to you and yours. Salute to the elite. Bam. Hey man, welcome back once again as we do it. Second time today. Second time today. What's up, Sleep? What's up, Don? What's going on, Skull? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Hope all is well. Let me let them know what we about to do. So we got this tournament right here. The Mighty Carp Tournament is going on. I did the first qualifying round at Tiber, Tiber. Did not go well. We about to do the second one. I was going to do it off the stream, but everybody said they want to see it, so we going to do it, man. Uh, we at San Joe Quinn. Making no promises. I, I just started fishing carp like last week and going to like Weeping Willow and some of the other uh, spots. So I really just started learning that. So, you know, this might not go well, but we're going to do it together. We're going to chop it up and see what it does. Um, I'm just making sure I got everything I need, or I pretty much got everything. I was going to buy a couple more of these um, bollies that I was using, these shellfish pop-ups. These things are expensive, too, but we're going we gonna to add a couple more. All right, that's good. I left, uh, I was at San Joe Quinn earlier and I left because I needed my carp rod. I got two carp rods. You can only use carps. I'm going to still use these two. See if I catch anything just to make some money while I'm sitting there. But we mainly going to do these. And I'm going to try to make some recipes. I got a recipe. I got it wrote down. So we're going to throw some of that together while we're there to try that out. See if it helps. If you use a spy rod, which I have the spy joint. Oh, uh, hold on. Like, you could catch tons of carp, but I'm not going to be able to use this. You actually got to buy a ride for this. I could buy it, I guess, and add it. I could do that. But I would be trying it out in the middle of the tournament, and I, I haven't really, really used that yet. So we'll do that next time. Ah, this will be the perfect time. What I'm going to do, guys, what I'm going to do, I'm not going to try it right now. What I do for round three tomorrow I'm going to figure out the spy ride before we start that. So round three, let's say I don't win. When we get ready to go here, I'm going to figure the spy ride thing out, and we'll add that to the repertoire. All right? So we're going to go ahead and get to it. Going to get to it. Let's see. Uh, You get in there to the time limit. Yes, it is a time limit. It's actually two hours. Um, But you only need 10 fish. But you're trying to get the 10 biggest fish. So we're going to see what it does. We're going to see what it does. Let's see. I got the six odd hook on there. I'm going to leave these sixes on here, I believe, for, for this lake. And, again, I think I got everything. I'm, I'm ready. I'm getting close to level 54. So, uh, okay, hold on. One more thing. Like, I'm trying to make sure. See any missions? The Chinook, I got that. Yeah. We good. We good. We're going to worry about the tourney. I can farm and get my money back if I need to. All right. We're going to travel there. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's see. Slushy going to school right now. All right. Whew. Okay. Okay. So I'm, I'm going to hit this area right here. This is where I'm going to fish from. There's one other carp spot a little further down on the other side, but we're going to do it right here. I think. Even though I'm logging in right now, the game is going to make me log in again once I activate the tournament. So we're going to make it work. I want to set my stand up, but again, I think it's going to... I'm going to set my stand up and just see, try to save that time, but I think it's still going to make me do it again. All right. All right, guys. Well, we ready. We're going we gonna to get to it. Hold on. Let me, let me take a sip. Make sure I'm properly hydrated. All right. 
Uh, let's get to it. Let's get to it. All right, we're going to do the San Joe Quinn 495 players. Wow. Let's go. They just blew the whistle. Boats are prohibited. All right. All right. We cannot use boats. We can use our ride stand. Okay, it's 6 p.m. They be having a little flags out there. That's pretty cool, letting you know you're in the tournament. All right, I'm going to put my stand down, and, and we just going to hope this spot works, guys. We're going to see what we get. Um. Okay, actually, I'm going to go ahead, and I am going to make some ground bait. So hold on. Let me, let me pull up my recipe real quick. We're going to put this in here. Y'all bear with me. Y'all bear with me. I, I'm, I'm getting my focus on for a second. And then we'll, we'll get back to chatting. All right. So, carp rival, 52. Uh, this big revering. You know what? It was some more of that I probably could have threw in there, but it's all good. Let's see, 17. Bam. Catfish destroyer. We're going to destroy, destroy these catfish. <laughs> Five ounces. Okay. Tutti Fruity Supreme. I stocked up on this stuff. Um. All right, let's see if I got enough for that. Two ounces. Sweet Crucian. And I think this works really well at Weeping Willow. But I'm going to try it here as well. Uh, this corn liquor. Corn liquor, one ounce. All right. And we're going to add some of these right here. Uh, where is that? Oil pea cake. Four ounce. Hemp corn. Four on this hemp corn and two on this Pastonia mix. All right, we're going to mix that up. Again, this recipe works really well at Weeping Willow. If I had that spied ride together, you can put it in the spy and then you throw them out. And you got to throw the whole thing out, though. You, you throw it out there like, 20 times, like just casting your ride, letting it go into the water and, and feel. But we're not going to do it like that. We're going to do it in the um, in the ride. So let me let me put this on here properly. I got PV. I bought a bunch of these. I didn't know these wear out. I thought I didn't know they were like single use every time you cash using this PV. So I was using these at another lake and it ran out. I was like, what's going on? I had to made all this ground bait, wasted all this money. Anyway, but we're going to work this out. All right, so we're going to put this in here. Okay, and see, it only used a little bit, but I couldn't even use the whole recipe. All right, then we got to bring our weight back. Got that, bam. All right, we're going to do the same thing, do our PVE. So, again, you can do it directly on the ride, or you could use the spy thing. I think the spy thing works better because it's, like th it's like throwing food into the water and all the carp just come. And guys, let me tell you, while I was at the beach, I was at the beach this weekend. That's where I was at. And um, we were at this place called Broadway. It's like this just this little area. And they got a whole boardwalk. It had a big lake. They had this big river thing. You could, I mean, this big boat that uh, multiple people could ride, but it was like a speedboat. But they had carp there. And they had the feeder joints where you could feed the carp. And the carp were just like, it was like hundreds of carp just sitting there, huge carp. But you couldn't fish them because, you know, you were at this like you were at this uh family place, but you could feed them and watch them go at it. All right, guys, here we go. I know I'm chatting. I'm chatting. All right. So we going. This is my spot right here. And hopefully we can get something back. Now, this spot does well even or at least during normal hours without the uh the ground bait 
So I'm hoping with the ground bait, like we really pull back some big ones. And if nothing hits, I'm going to be PO'd because <laughs> this spot be rocking. Y'all was here with me today. So this will let you know how these tournaments be rigged or something because when we were here earlier, I was using no ground bait, throwing these out there, and I was just pulling carp out back to back to back, trophies and everything. So we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, man. All right. So now we're here. We're going to play the waiting game a bit. But yeah, man, how y'all day been going so far? So far, man. Glad to see everybody who here with me again, too, man. Thank you guys for joining. I'm going to throw this out just to see if it catches anything. Nez, what up, Nez? What's going on? What's going on? Now, if this one go off with corn, but these ain't going off, it's rigged. It's rigged. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing good, doing good. How are you? How are you? Now, look at this one. Uh, I might have did it too early. Yeah, I did it too early. Again, how this one going off with these ain't? When I was at Tiber, like, I only caught two, like, two fish, uh, two carp. Okay, there we go. I need that thing to light up. Okay, this the one that matters. I done caught something big on this line, but this done, they not going to even count this because it got to be a carp ride. I need these two carp rides to go off. I really just threw this out as a test just to see if it was a difference because the carp ride should definitely be the one that's, that's active before this one is. And look at this. It's like a trophy out the gate. Look at that trophy comic carp. And I just did a Carp Master Challenge. But again, it don't count. Nice. X-Series Fluoro. Okay. 0.25. Catch a certain number of Carp. Nice, nice, nice. Let me go on and get that. All right. So I'm going to wait. Hey, what's up, Werewolf? What's going on? What's up, Remus? What's good? What's good? All right. Here we go. Here we go. It's going. Up. Oh, they both. Ah. Is it going? Is it going? There we go. We got a hit, guys. We got a hit. This one will count towards the tournament. This one will count towards the tournament. Um, Dom, I've never made it very far in the tournament before. Like the first round. I, I've never placed or anything. So if we place or make it on this one, like even to the second round, to the uh, what is the quarterfinals, semifinals, like that'll be dope. Y'all y'all have a part in it, man. Y'all be why. All right, come on. Come on. You lighten up. There we go. There we go. All right. Now, that other carp I caught on the regular ride was bigger than these two, but we're going to take it for now. Long as I'm catching them, I'm glad because I only caught two at Tiber, so I'm just happy to catch something. We'll get a trophy or two. We'll get a trophy or two. There it is. Well, we did get a trophy. It's only 20. That's a start. That's a start. Say, what's good, Remus? I had a fish out today. Yeah, man. Look, I'm doing this tourney, trying to make it happen. Trying to win that 500,000 and them 5,000 bait coins. Werewolf. Oh, you were in your car. Hey, that's cool, man. Look, glad you checked in, man. How you doing? How you doing? Werewolf, I know you are OG. Have you done any tournaments? How many tournaments have you done, should I say? Nez, you say you bought the Saltwater DLC. You've been farming Blue Crab until your premium runs out on Sunday. Nice. Nice. I want to get that pack, too. Um, I think Blue Crab finna open. I'm level 53. I think Blue Crab opens at 54, and I'm almost there. But, uh, but we'll see. 
Ah, this dude mad that ain't nobody comment on his uh <laughs> he got a uh let, let me help him out. Let me help him out. Nice one. There you go, guy. He need recognition because he called a unique. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, man. So you posted a shark catch on the kayak on your YouTube. Oh, nice. You caught a shark on the kayak. Did it flip you over? Or were you letting it pull you around, drag you around? Hey, what's up, Corey? What's going on? What's going on? Feel like the game's going to be rigged. Yeah, that's how it is. That's how it is. Let's see. You need 10 50-pounders. Yeah, man. You do. You need 10 50-pounders. I don't call it a 20-pounder, but I'm going to need like 10 unis. You see these people got 62-pounders. Uh, let's see. You saw me get third place in the team comp last night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. And I done spent up all my bait coins. I've been doing those custom competitions, winning like five and ten bait coins for the last three, four days. Man, I've been spending them up buying markers. I had to expand my storage. Um, I got ten bait coins after I've been winning all them joints. But at least I know I can replace them. Let's see. No turn is yet. Uh, you wanted to, but hadn't had the free time. Okay, I understand. I understand. Lots of flips. Why me? Hey, what's up? Why me? What's up, why? What's going on? How goes it? How goes it? Let's see, you have to flip the kayak challenge. You got to flip 150 times. Goodness. Uh, you was level 27. Now you 34 in two days. Yeah, man. You had your leveling up like crazy. All right, that's a comment. Let's see what this one is. Let's see what this one is. All right, come on. Come on. I'm going to have to cast it back out. I caught. I got to check my map. I think I caught a uni. Hold on. Let me let it move. Uh, you completed that catching sharks. <laughs> nice. I bet. I'm sure that shark had you flipping tons of times. The uh, At White Moose. The 40 pound trout used to have me flipping. So I know that one had you flipping. See, these in the shallows. I might have to go for this up here. I caught a Carmen up here, a common up here in the depth area. I'm about to try one thing right here, too, because um Mark was telling me that if I just cash like right here, I should catch a unique. I'm gonna see if I can catch a unique casting right here. And then I go back to the to the other spot where we've been fishing. And in fact, let me pick this back up. I want to zoom real quick. I just want to see if I can see this marker. I got a marker like way over there on the other side, but I can't really see it. And it's in a much deeper area, though. Let me pull this other ride out and see. I'm going to try to cast way to this other side, if, and I'm going to give it maybe five minutes. If nothing hits, then I'll bring it back. But it was way out there. Okay, let me look at my map. Let me look at my map. Um, Okay, it's to the right, just a little more. To the right, just a little more. It's behind that little foilage right there. All right, I'm going to just cast over this. And just go full blast. Far as it'll go. Look at how long that thing go. Bam. That took a minute. I don't know if it caught the deepest part or not. I was trying to catch the deepest area. Corey said you caught a trophy both in and two both in today. Nice, nice. Uh, so your max in the kayak was a 330 trophy. Wow, nice. Jonathan, hey, what's going on, Jonathan? How goes it? How goes it? Dom said you're going to get that gar pack and do the gar tourney next month. Okay. I'll probably enter that one too. Just because now, you know, been having the money. Long as you gotta have some extra money because you gotta pay to travel around. I did this one because of course, you know, and I'm I'm in the uh the the six figures. So, you know, dropping that 20 ain't too crazy. And then even when I need to leave and practice and stuff like that, you get licenses. That's another reason I did this, cause you know, even though it costs 20. 
you get unlimited licenses for these five days or whatever it is to all the lakes that you fish at. That's a uh, Tiber, Sander Burgis, whatever that name is, San Joaquin, uh, Weeping Willow, and one other one. And you basically got free reign other than the, the travel cost. So I said, you know, I can practice. I can also knock out some challenges and things of that nature while I'm here. And that's what I've been doing. That's what I've been doing. Let's see. You would have been here earlier uh, when the stream started, but you got distracted. <laughs> hey, no worries. No worries. You're here now. Sleek, going to brush your teeth to stay clean. All right. All right. Hey, what's up, Warrior? What's going on? Let's see. Good to see you on right now. You logging in as well. Do some fishing. Uh, glad you got the stream. That's what's up, man. Hey, glad to have you here. I'm doing this tournament. You know, we seeing how it goes. When you do the tourneys, you just got to get 10 fish, 10 catches. So we're trying to get the 10 biggest catches. But some of these people, they got some crazy catches. Look like they averaged about 60 to 50. Yeah, you at least got to do 10 fives. They call multiple uniques. Multiple uniques. All right, this one's going. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We need a unique. We need a unique. All right, this one heavy. It might not be a unique, but it's heavy. Okay, he running a bit. He running a bit. That's a good sign. When they don't come straight in, you already know. Hey, shout out to Mark. When Mark come through here tomorrow, I got to let him know because that was his spot. He told me to fish over there. This is at least a trophy. Can we get that uni? Yeah, there we go. There we go. We got us a uni. We got us a uni. Nice, nice, nice. We going to go on and keep that for the tournament. Going to get a pick. Ah, oh, I got the little flag behind me and stuff. That's nice. All right. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, Mark called it. Now, when you use the spot, that's the thing with that spot thing. I might should have tried it anyway. When you use the spot, you can catch multiple uniques. So the game has that thing where you can only catch uh, one unique of each fish a day. But... That rule doesn't apply when you use that spy ground bait. If you throw that spy out there, it makes so many fish come that it breaks the rule. That's something I like read or, or saw somebody say. So, yeah, I'm going to reel this one back. I ain't going to let it sit. So I'm hoping that using this ground bait in the PVA applies the same logic. That just doesn't only apply to that spy ride thing. Because if that's the case, I, I should have brought it out and just tried it anyway. Yeah, we'd have tested it all out. But it's all good. I think it's still going to work with this. <laughs> I'm, I'm hoping it's still going to work with this. Hey, what's up, Austin? What's going on? What's going on? How goes it? Hey, thank you. Thank you. Look, glad to have you here. Let's see. We'll go back here just to keep catching them. And really appreciate that. What's up, Jake? What's going on? What's going on? How goes it? Welcome to the stream. All right, guys. Look, I'm 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 happy already that we done caught what five already? Is that four or five? Just to even be in the running. Uh, who was that? One of my guys hit me and said that they were we in Discord or maybe that was in uh my comments on YouTube. Said they did the tourney and um they did the tourney and they got like two ten. So we're gonna see what we do here. Because when I did the Tiber, they did Tiber too, of course, didn't do well. Neither neither of us did well, but they did do two ten here. So we can see where we place. If we get a top 100, I'd be good. I'd be happy about that. All right, here we go. Here we go. Go on and get it. Go on and get it. Uh, you heard that the spot is the way to go. Yeah, yeah. 
and I have one. There is a um, if you catch, there's a mission. If you catch carp at the at Tiber, Sander, and Weeping Willow, it's a certain size. You get that spy rod. I did that, so I got it. Before we came in, I just would have had to buy the spy ride because you know it's a special ride and then a reel probably like a spin reel to use it i never actually used it before but i pr i probably should have just went ahead and did it and tried it out just went on and bought it and brought it to the lake with us but it is what it is what i said i'll do is for that Oct october i'm gonna get it uh between tonight and tomorrow and we'll take it to october and, and see if we can get that spy ride working King J, what's up? What's up? Hey, doing good, doing good. How you doing? All right, here we go. All right, there you go. You gotta wait on it sometimes. They be pump faking. Okay, this one. This one a little heavy too now. I don't know if he gonna be a uni, but he a little heavy. This one probably just a trophy. Probably just a trophy. He coming in. Yeah, okay. He got a little weight to him. There we go. All right, yeah, it's a trophy, 29. Not bad, not bad. We're going to go back once again. Once again, it's on. Yeah, I'm doing good, doing good. Can't complain. Been a good day. We jumping back on for a second stream. Doing this tournament. Seeing where we place. Seeing if I can get some multiple unis. Yeah, these top five people, they had to get multiple units. They use spies. They use spies. Um, Cause to get 500, you gotta be averaging. That's like 10, 50 pounders. And they got a 60 pounder. So it looks like they probably got some six, a 60 pounder, a 40, 50, you know, kind of all in between that range. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, hey, welcome back. Welcome back. Yeah. How's your day been? How's it been since earlier? Everything been going well? What's up, live? Let's see. You finally caught me. You're on the PS4. It takes you forever to figure out the controls and what to use. Yeah, yeah. The controls can be a little funky, especially in the menus. Fishing, it ain't so bad. But yeah, especially in the menus. I still will jump the mouse and keyboard when I'm in the menus because... One minute you using the right stick or you using the pad, and then the other minute you using the left stick to move stuff on the right side. It's hard to get your brain to, to you know, consistently do that. It's hard to train that that muscle, get that muscle memory. Uh oh, what y'all gonna do? Stop playing. I need one of y'all to go off for real. See, they both was on some teasing. Uh, you getting better, at least not worse. That's what's up. That's what's up. Look, you either getting better or you getting worse. <laughs> Come on. All right, I think this one live. I think this one live. There we go. There we go. There we go. Ah, man, it's a small guy. Oh, wait a minute. Might be bigger than I think. Might be. Nah. This is going to be a regular. Regular schmegler. Regular schmegler. It's adding to the total, but 
Not enough. We need more uniques. I think not bringing that spy might come back to haunt me. I don't know. All right, this one going off. This one going off. All right, let's get this. Let's get this. Let's get this. Let's see. Let's see. Now nah, they've been pretty big right over over there in that spot. Oh, not this time. It's a little guy. Ah, the commons are coming out, guys. The commons are coming out. I <laughs> say that's how you are in some games. I feel you. Uh, the Jaguars got Trevor Lawrence. Hey, yeah, yeah. Y'all, they might do a little something. Y'all might do a little something with him. Let's see. You got a GeForce Racing Wheel Xbox Series S and a PC. So you open the games. Nice, nice. I mean, I was looking today. I almost ordered me an Xbox Series S, but they didn't have it. It said they had it at like Target or, or uh, some store, Staples or something, but they ain't have it in stock. I need a next gen, a, a next gen console. I want the five because I got I play my PS4 more than my Xbox, even though I used to play my Xbox heavy. But um, and I wanted to get 2K, so I wanted to be able to upgrade. So, but I've been playing it on PS, so I just went on and got it on PS. But yeah, I'm gonna still probably get a Series S just because they're the only thing available. It's the same as the X; it just don't got the drive and less memory but yeah i'll probably end up getting that uh that series s until the x come out so they really available in two years a couple years from now and yeah i got a uh i didn't know they got geforce racing wheel though that's what's up i need to look at that. i want to see what that look like i got a uh ps4 racing wheel i don't know it's back there i don't know if you can see it oh no i hooked it up right there this my racing wheel right here. I got the PS4 joint. I actually just pulled it back out. I had it uh put up for a minute. And um I used to use it for like I got Assetto Corso. That's like the I don't know how familiar familiar y'all are with that. I don't know if that's on console or not. Assetto Corso is like the Forza Gran Turismo for the PC for Steam. It's very real, but the interface is kind of... The interface ain't pretty. But the game is very legit. All right, here we go. We got us another one. We got us another one. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get any more uniques without that spied, man. If you enter the tourney, you got to get your spied. I got to test out that October place and uh, find the spots there and use that spy ride. Because these joints on their own, they ain't enough. All right, this one tugging. Rug tug tugger. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's all right. We're going to see. Maybe some more uniques will pop out. We're going to see. We're going to see. Austin, you say you got your PC as well? Nice. Okay, this one is 10 pounds. So we'll release this one. We'll release the smallest one. And we will keep going. Let's keep it. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Let me try over here a bit. Let's see. You just caught a 43-pound uni pike. Nice. Nice. You want me to zoom in on what? And I be forgetting you can actually control the zoom. You can actually control your zoom. I don't know if y'all know that. You can control your zoom.
All right, all right, all right. Well, again, if you are going to join the tourney for this carp, you got to get you a spy ride. I recommend doing the mission. This the mission right here I did to get the spy ride. This trophy carp bollies. Equip the carp rod and bollies. You need a carp ride. Tiber, Sander, Bagger C, and Weeping Willow. And I got this. And uh, But again, I didn't pull it out. And it's 20,000 XP. They got this up real good. Three bait coins, 3,500. But yeah, I hadn't practiced with it yet. So I got to use it. See what it does. I'm going to throw out my other ride just to catch something extra. Just for the money. Just for the money. Must be the money. All right. All right. Yeah, man. Where any of y'all fishing? Where y'all at? What lakes y'all fishing? What lakes are you fishing? Where you been fishing at today? This one with corn gonna probably go off before both of these do. So you at the fishery, okay. Oh, there we go. Uh oh. Uh oh, they both gone. There they go. This one coming in kind of fast. Might just be a common. Okay, 10 pounds. All right, I can release this one. And we'll keep that one. Let me go over this way a bit. Let's see if that makes a difference. <laughs> you fishing in Lake <laughs> Sleepy Bed. <laughs> yeah, Michigan Dom, nice, nice. Let's see you at Colorado to save up for the Everglades. Okay, cool, cool. Nez, you'll be back at Blue Crab in four hours. That's what's up. Say so when you finish work. Yeah, I'm ready to get the Blue Crab myself. I just need a little bit more uh, XP. All right, let me see if I can catch something else while I'm sitting here. Where can we fish? I believe Steelhead sit over here. Let's see if we can catch something over here. Oh, we got a hit. We got a hit. Take it. There it is. We got a hit. That's either a steelhead or a bass. Almost look like it could be a Chinook. Oh, we got a Chinook. Oh, I'm going to have to let him go. You not a carp. <laughs> got to let you go. I got to let you go. I almost would have kept that, though, if it would have been a... Uh, I'm trying to get that mission. I need a 33 pound Chinook. I started to keep that guy, but if he'd have been 33 pounds, I don't know. I might have thought about it. Let's see you doing 30 days in Michigan. What's the reward? I believe the 30 day Michigan is a uh, is a X series spinner. It's a real good like a, a trophy spinner. What you call it? That's is it spinner bait. 
not spinner bait, bullet spinner. I believe that's it. I might be wrong. It's either that or it's a um a narrow spoon. Uh, let's see. This one's smaller than the rest. Got to let you go. Got to let you go. Let's throw right here. Do y'all know offhand what the uh, reward is for the 30 days at St. Croix? Somebody let me know in the comments. Hey, what's up, Blue Ninja? What's going on? What's going on? How goes it? How goes it? How you doing? Uh-oh. I'm getting a YouTube. I'm getting an error with the string, guys. If something happened with the string, I'm going to have to come back. You might have a stream issue. Oh, it's saying it might not be smooth. Hey, I'm doing good, doing good. Can't complain. Can't complain. Yeah, I'm getting a little message that uh the stream might not be smooth for a second. I don't know why. So y'all bear with me. All right, there we go. That's a hit. You got to give it time. You got to give it time. Give me some time. Oh, this one kind of heavy. This one kind of heavy. He probably a trophy though. He not a uh he not a uni, but he a trophy. Nice. Got us another trophy in there. All right, let's cut out this smallest one. Bam. And let's keep him. Yeah, for some reason, I'm getting a uh, YouTube like notification about the data. So if it goes out, guys, I'm going to try to just bring it back. Hopefully, it'll be straight. Faze, what's going on? What's going on? How goes it? How goes it? Yeah, guys, if you see any issue, YouTube having some issue. My stream is strong, but it's not getting the YouTube right. So, have an issue, you know, appreciate y'all being here. I'm going to try to start it back up. If not, we'll get back on it later. And um, I'll let y'all know what happens tomorrow.
Yeah, we having some type of technical difficulty, guys. What's up, Faze? Say you thought you was already a sub, but go ahead and sub, man. And y'all hit that like button just in case this stream act up or or conk out. Y'all hit that like button for me, guys, if you hadn't done so already. No, I appreciate y'all being here. Everybody who here rocking with me. Something up with the string. Oh, I jumped on it too early. It's fine now. Okay. Hopefully it'll stay right. Hopefully it'll stay right. I might be a little out of sync. I think I'm a little ahead of y'all. Okay. All right. The condition back excellent. So we good. But again, I think I might be like a little ahead of y'all where it's normally just in not perfect sync, but you know what I mean? Fairly close with the sync. And now it's looking like I might be yeah ahead a bit. Say so you on white moose Lake, nothing much. Just finished the monster mission. Nice. Nice. Uh oh, this is a decent size one. Yeah, congrats on that monster. Corey, you like sub, click the bell. Hey, appreciate that, appreciate that. Be on the lookout for more good content. Ah, this is a trophy. Hold on. So wait, I thought I had to use carp rides. So I can keep this with my regular ride? I did not know that. I did not know that. Okay, I'm about to release this and keep this. Yo, it's letting me keep them with my regular ride? I did not know that. Let me pull out my fourth ride. I thought it said you had to use all carp rides. Yeah, I thought I had to use all carp rides. Maybe I do. Let me let me double check this. 10 of 10, 10, 31. Uh, that's about the same. I mean, it weighs a little bit more. You need to be about six hours ahead to catch you in the UK. <laughs> I heard that. All right, all right. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. I'm coming. Let's go. Let's go. You acting like you are unique. Let's see if this one worth keeping. Nah. Not worth keeping. Not worth keeping. All right, come on. Come on back. You're taking your time. Come on. This one is not a trophy, but... It's a catch nonetheless. I don't know. It could be. It's coming in pretty fast, though. Nah, we'll release that one. 
we will release that one. Scoreboard in game updated. I do not know. Good question. All right, all right, all right. Let's get this other carp out here. Let me get my other ride out. Get my fourth one. We got corn on this one too. Corn on the cop. Sorry you couldn't be here for the rest of the stream, but if you don't go to bed, then you won't wake up for work. Hey, good night, sleep, man. Appreciate you being here. You know that's always going to get you some rest, man. Appreciate you hanging out, but yes, going to get you some rest. Get ready for work tomorrow and have a great day at work. Don't work too hard, you know. Save some energy for the fishing and the strength. Yeah, have a great day tomorrow. Uh, okay, I let this one go. A little bit better. Little bit better. See, this game is so great for stress. Yeah, it's very relaxing, very calming, very soothing. Oh, this is like a little one. Is this even a carp? What is this? Catfish? Ty, we call it a catfish. Nah. Nah, catfish. Hmm. Let's see, I haven't been able to catch a catfish yet or bass or trout, but you're on level 16. Oh, yeah, yeah, you'll get there. You'll get there. you catch plenty. If you go to mud water, you can catch a lot of catfish. They don't make a lot of money, but... You can catch a lot of catfish in mud water. I got a video for that showing you where to catch the uh the catfish. Let's see, bass or trout. Yeah, now bass, you know you can catch bass at Lone Star. Trout, that depends on what lake you go to. You're gonna have to hit Rocky or Falcon or uh one of those other lakes if you really want to catch some trout. See if I can. Oh, no, that's right. I can't keep it. I want to fish for my Chinook salmon, but I can't keep it. I got to remember that because I go catch it. All right, which one of y'all really going to go off? See, they playing, and now they all want to go off together. Now they want to all go off together. Okay, this one a big one. Oh, this might be another uni, guys. He out there like a tank, like Jaws. When they just ignore the fact that they hooked, this might be another uni. I'm going to have to let them other ones go and just hope that they ain't no unis. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. You timed out. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, we got to get this one in. I ain't going to even worry about the other ones. I want to. I want to try and juggle them, but yeah, I feel like this is a uni right here. Is this a uni? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, we're going to let that one go. Oh! 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 No! All right, my bad. I was trying to release the fish out of the doggone thing, and I let go of my unique. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. 
It's all right. It was only a 40-something pound unique and not a 60-pound unique. So it's okay. I'm going to calm down. I'm not going to get upset. I'm just going to recast these lines again, and we're going to carry on. Yes, we're going to carry on. These are nice little happy fish. We're in a nice happy place. We're in a nice happy place. Hap, 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 happy. All right. Uh, you need help with rise. You don't know what kind to use. Ah! I don't want y'all to see me getting angry. <laughs> so I'm trying to be cool here. I am trying to be cool here. Okay. All right. What you need help with on your rides? What you need help with on your rides? Let me, let me, uh, let me be on something positive. Yeah, what, what issues are you having with your rides? You don't know what kind to use. It's going to come back. It's going to come back. It's going to come back and I'm going to get a bigger one. Mm. It's going to come back. That was just a test. Yeah. We'll catch another one. We will catch another one. All right. BA. Yeah, look, I'm I'm, I'm trying to. I, I might have uh got a little more upset or yeah, no, through something or something, but I'm trying to be calm for y'all, you know, so I got everybody here. I'm trying to be cool, you know. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. Yeah, uh, let's see. Is it live or live? I want to say because I want to say it right. I'm going to say live, but I feel like it was live at first. Live with meter and no measure. Or live with no meter and no measure. We're going to say live for now. Um, You say you don't know what to use. You need help with your rides. You don't know what kind to use. So what kind of fishing are you trying to do? What kind of fishing is it you're trying to do? Like, what are you trying to catch? And we might can help you figure that out with your ride set up. Nicholas. Hey, it's all good. No worries. No worries. Look, welcome back. Welcome back. Right now we are in a tournament and we going for carp. Eric. Hey, thank you for the subscription. You are elite. Appreciate that. Yeah, like I'm, I'm holding them back. I'm holding them back. Whoo. That'd have been the second. Uh, Uni, Jay, but it's all good though. It's all good. Things happen. Things happen to the best of us. You know, you got to work through it. You got to work through it. It's going to come back. All right, cool. Got us another hit. This one might be a trophy. Not the uni, but this one might be a trophy the way he the way he waddling. All right, this is a trophy. All right. We're gonna press the correct button this time. Let's let this one go. X. Now to keep them. A. There we go. Let's see. I lost about 30 pounds. That would have had me at about 200. It's all good. All good. All good. Hey, much love to you, Nicholas. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. 
Yeah, Dom, it could. But you know what? It is what it is. It is what it is. Y'all get to see the good and the bad. Get to see the good and the bad. Let's see. You mostly in the Texas level. And the check. Okay. Anything that would be good for those levels. Also, are boats even worth it? Um, Not at this point. I would say um, you want to get you a kayak eventually or a boat if you can get a boat. You're not really going to need a boat till you get to like Emerald Lake, though. And I'm thinking, what is that, Rocky or Falcon? One of those you can use boats. If you are like starting out and you're really trying to get some money and level, I wouldn't even um, get a European lakes or rivers. They don't make a lot of money. Um, not till you get to some of the higher level ones. Like Lesney Villa, it's not worth it. I went out, uh, let's see, release that. And you ain't going to earn a lot of money. The best thing for you to do is just get you like an early, like one of those first spin rides. Get you one that's um, 9, 10 pounds. Keep spinning. You might have that already. Keep spinning at Lone Star Lake. Save up enough to get you a uh, save up enough to go to Emerald Lake. You know, save up maybe like five, six K. Go to Emerald Lake. Make sure you got a narrow spoon with you and just farm walleye. You farm walleye, you'll make a lot of money. You could you could probably make five, six K a day and then keep upgrading your equipment. You'll upgrade your ride, your reel, your keep net. You want to get that keep net bigger. That way you can fish longer each day. And I don't know if you're doing this or not. This is just a reminder for anybody who is new. Do not leave the lake. Whenever you got to cash out your fish, I didn't know this when I first started playing. I had to learn the hard way because I'm like, man, I ain't making no money. Don't leave the lake when you fill up your net. Just go to the next day. It'll cash in your fish. You'll pay the little fee and you'll keep going. And that's how you save. And then as you grow your keep net, you can fish longer each day. But yeah, I would do that. And then maybe as you're leveling up and you save and maybe get you a feeder ride or a match ride. I like feeder ride because it got the bell on it. But match rides usually catch average catching uh, bigger or better, more targeted fish. You want to have you a couple rides, you know, get you a ride case, get you a ride stand so you can at least have one ride sitting in the water, match your feeder while you fishing. Uh, let's see, you thinking and level up a bit. Uh, some of the stuff isn't unlocked. Yeah, yeah. Again, just save up enough at Lone Star to go to Emerald Lake. It seem, it's going to seem like a lot. When you first starting out, but you'll be good. Like, don't even worry about that. You'll make a lot of money there. You just need narrow spoon, stop and go, throw it out in the middle as far as it'll go, and just stop and go it in. And yeah, you'll make good money like that. Uh, yeah, narrow spoon. That's lure for a spin ride. So don't. Ah, uh, might have grabbed this too early. Don't put that on. Don't put that on a uh, match ride. Make sure it's a spinner. You get you a spin ride. That's just a catfish. Get out of here, catfish. <laughs> I actually could catch some sturgeon right now. All right, let's see. Let's see what this is. All right, all right, all right. Nah, this is a regular. It's a common carp, common carp. Uh, Nicholas always recommends the golden, the golden uh pack, the golden DLC.
It's a pack with a lot of uh, tackle and gear in it, but it does cost. It covers about everything, though. It does give you a lot. It has a lot in that pack. But, uh, yeah, if you're grinding it out, yeah, no worries. Let me know. Uh, let me know how it goes. And, again, you stop through or, or just comment on any of the uh, videos. If you got any questions, man, I'll help you out. We can figure out what ride or, you know, what reels, what setup you use. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Whew. This is the grind of the tournament, man. Even when doing competitions, I like the 30-minute competitions. Some of them be 45. Some of them are um, an hour. When they get over an hour, I be like, eh, I don't know about that. That's a bit much. That is a bit much. Let me see how many of these PVE things I got. Make sure I ain't running out of them. Uh, where they at? Okay, 96. I'm good. I bought quite a few of them. It look like nighttime, it might be slowing up. I might have to cast one of these joints somewhere else. Maybe cast it to the other side. We're going to try that over here. What's up, Edward? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, yeah, this is the free version. If you're talking about the Fisherman, um, I own that. Like, I bought it, but I ain't even played it. It's just sitting in my Steam queue. But I did get the Fisherman, though. Because I was going to do some series on it, but, you know, they don't really support it like that. Hey, appreciate everybody who here. Appreciate everybody who rocking with me. We doing a tournament right now, this carp tournament. Hit that like button if you're here. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you are not subscribed. Share if you can share. Follow on Twitch. Do all that good stuff. Uh, let's see, you got to try and get some sleep. Hopefully, you'll be able to do some fishing tomorrow, later on. All right, hey, get you some rest. Get you some rest. Hey, come through tomorrow. I do plan to stream tomorrow. Uh, Thursday is usually one of the regular days. Just jumped on today and then wanted to do this tournament since we got this tournament going on. But, yeah, uh, just stop through. Look out for the, for the noti or, you know, look out for the stream. And, again, anytime, man, just holler. Just holler. You take it easy. Have a good one. Peace, blessings. Have a great day tomorrow. Have a great weekend. We we get closer to the weekend. We through hump day. So we'll be there soon. All right, come on, carps. Come on, carps. <laughs> All right, we halfway there. We halfway there, guys. Hey, appreciate it, Corey. We are halfway there. Let's see, the biggest carp I caught is, it's really only been like a 40-something pound uni. I still haven't caught a 60-pound uh, uni. It might have been up to 50, but I'm thinking it's still pretty much like this 40, around what I caught here, like a 46-pounder. All 
All right, Carp, let's go. We'll do us a recast, see if that makes a difference. See if that makes a difference. Come on, come on. This carp, man, that's the only thing with carp. Unless you use that spy, it can get a little boring. We doing that tournament life. Tournament life. All right, so let's see, let's see. All right, guys, so what lakes do you like to fish at? What's your favorite lake? What's your favorite lake? Y'all let me know. What's your favorite fishing planet lake? And uh, what's your favorite fishing planet lake? And then do you like to fish? Like, are you a, like a grinder? Do you like to make money? Do you like to fish for fun? Or is, is it more casual? Do you even feel like you can fish casually on this game? Because like you want to let you grind a little bit. Got to grind a little bit. You got to, got to. Yeah, I feel like these cars might move. Hey, good night, Corey. Have a good one. Have a great day tomorrow. Peace. Blessings. Take it easy. Hope you and your family are well. And again, I hope you have a, a great day tomorrow. You have a good one. Let's see. At the moment, you prefer St. Croix. Uh, you're trying to get some money and XP together. Okay. That's what's up. What's up, Igor? Yeah, St. Croix is a good one. St. Croix is a good one. You can't go wrong farming those pikes. Uh-oh. That might be the move. They might have moved to this other side. Because it uh, it's after 10. Let's see. Emerald is the OG. St. Croix is your moneymaker. Okay. Okay. CFC, what up, what up? Can I swim? Yes. I can swim. If you talking about in real life, I can swim. If you can't swim, you bound to drizzle. I taught myself to swim when I was like, what, 10? Something like that. Somewhere between 8 and 12 is when I taught myself how to swim. Can you swim? Let's see what this one did. Swimming is the most important thing. Okay. I mean, it's definitely going to preserve you if you fall in the water. Uh, oh no, absolutely. Like, <laughs> drowning is not something you would want to happen. Like, there's nothing pleasant about drowning. But yeah, no, I can swim. Like I said, I've been swimming since I was a kid. Now, I ain't got the air, the lung capacity like I used to have. Or I get my dolphin on, but uh, nah, I can still swim. I actually was with the family of the day swimming uh, when I was at the beach. 
Okay, you a beginner? Okay, well, hey, we all start as beginners. We all start as beginners. Come on, come on. I had to refresh my screen. Uh, what state? Uh, I'm in the Carolinas. Or well, from the Carolinas. Hence why I rock uh, the Panthers and the Hornets. You probably ain't seen my hat collection, but yeah. Or some of the other videos. Always repping. Yeah, it looks like the nighttime is getting a little, uh, oh, wait a minute. I might be speaking too soon. Might be speaking too soon. I'm about to start talking junk about the night fishing. Like, where the carp? Let's see. White Moose is your best farm at the moment, but you just leveled up enough for St. Croix and San Joe Quinn, whatever it's called. Okay. There we go. Uh, yeah, let that go. Yeah, St. Croix is good money. White Moose is still a good money maker. If you able to save up your bait coins, White Moose is one I recommend getting an unlimited license for. I saved up and stacked to get that thing. And uh, it definitely pays off. Not having to pay that 8000 a day. You know, being able to lead a game and not have to worry about your license expiring and having to uh, pay again. I was there yesterday and the day before, I believe. And I was doing about 30K a day. Yeah, White Moose is good money. Uh, let's see what I plan on streaming tomorrow. It'll probably be Fishing Planet. I don't know since I did two videos a day, I might play something else. But uh, most likely, it'll still be Fishing Planet. Because I got Car Mechanic. I do need some builds. I got a Beamer I need to finish building. And then um, Green Hill still haven't streamed that yet. So I'm thinking about it again. The game is just so unforgiving. I'm not doing well on it. So um, that's why I hadn't streamed. Y'all be watching me die over and over again. Uh, let's see. Also got to the ocean. Yeah, I did get to the ocean. Yeah, yeah. No, we got rivers. We got oceans. Yep. Hutton the Heron uh, on here is based on a real river, if I'm not mistaken. I believe the real river is the Muharren River, but they changed. I don't know why they changed. Because the, some stuff, the real name and some stuff isn't. Yeah, Curry. Yeah, Curry went to school uh, right up the road, not too far from here. And I actually used to go to a lot of Hornets games and uh, would see Dale. Let's see. Let's let that one go. Yeah, see his dad. I actually seen his dad play back when the Hornets were, you know, when he was with the original Hornets uh, when I was really young. And then I seen Steph. I went to a game. I went to a Hornets game on New Year's a couple years ago and uh, saw LeBron. LeBron played for on a New Year's game. 
I had some real good seats too. Oh, I had some real good seats. So I could see him. He was like real close. I had like some half court seats and like the maybe like 12 rows back, 10 rows back. Real good seats. Uh oh, what it's doing, what it's doing. Oh, you bought the unlimited lights for white moose, man. That is a great investment. Yeah, that unlimited for white moose is a great investment. And again, you don't got to pay that recurring license fee. What's the license there? Like eight thousand? It's either four thousand or eight thousand. Yeah, not having to pay that saves a ton of money. Uh, Green Hell is so fun once you figure everything out. Yeah, I need to just like sit back on and just dedicate, you know, some time and just really figure it out. Cause from what I've discerned, Green Hell isn't so much about the typical survival, like when you play other survival games, like food, you know, water, um, worrying about raids and attacks. That's in there, but and usually you avoid like getting sick or, you know, getting dysentery or something. In that game, it's going to happen. You're going to get poisoned by a snake or a spider. You're going to, you know, um, get some type of ailment or get sick. You just got to learn how to fix it. And that's just what I ain't uh, learned well or accepted. Because you got to just learn how to fix those issues and those ailments. They're going to come. It's just a part of that game. You just can't let them get you to the point that they take you out. All right, this is another big one. This is probably just a trophy. Although he is fighting a bit. He a lunker, but he's still probably just a trophy. Yeah, okay, but a nice trophy nonetheless. All right. Release the fish. Keep the fish. Having to make sure we don't have another mishap. All right, all right. Let's see what do we have here. Well, if nothing else, when I have to cash in these fish. It should make a good little chunk of change. Good little chunk of change. That one ain't big enough. Nine, six. All right, got to let you go. It's things too that you kind of got to catch and release. I'm wondering, now, has anybody done this tournament? Because, like, if I feel like I'm not going to really be able to catch anymore, I don't know, can you just end it? I guess I can't hit finish and it'll just cash in my chips. Rocky Trout. Ooh, 20 bait coins. I might have to enter that. Rocky Lake, 3.30 a.m.? Nah, I ain't going to be up that late. <laughs> I'm going to be up that late. It's definitely a learning curve, but once you get it, you good. Okay. Yeah, I just got to take some more time with it. Take some more time with it. Hey, what's up, Moto? Hey, you saying car mechanic, you got an Anton to flip, but it's so cool. You're going to keep it up. Nice, nice, nice. That's what's up. Yeah, I've been enjoying car mechanic, man. Really, really enjoyable game. It's real laid back and chill, too. 
But yeah, it's just something about working on them cars, man. It, it's just something to it. Something to it and something addictive about it, you know, uh, servicing and renting. I hope they are able to add some more like updates and upgrades to it. Um, I hope they left that window open in the coding that maybe they can make it where we can even expand more. I know they're going to add DLC like branded cars like they did with Nissan. I'm sure they're going to add Chevy and, um, you know, Toyota or Chrysler or something. But, yeah, I hope they add more to the game beyond the base, like maybe being able to expand your garage even further. Uh-oh. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? And they going opposite directions. Jace, what's going on? What's going on? How goes it? How goes it? Welcome to the stream. All right, this another one that could be a uni. I think it's just going to be a trophy, though. It's coming in too fast. Yeah, this one's going to be a trophy, though. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Release, keep. Ah, both these joints going off. Okay, we going for number three. Come on, come on. Ah, doggone it. All right, number four, number four. That one was, was pulling kind of strong, like he might have been something. Yeah, doing good, doing good. I cannot complain. I cannot complain. How? We'll release that. Let's recast. Let's say you want a game where you can do old classic cars. Eh. Now, are you on um, PC? Because if you're on PC, you know that a lot of people add cars to the workshop. And a lot of times they add some classic, uh, classic joints. And I don't think they got the workshop, though, on consoles, like from 30s to 70s. Okay. Yeah, definitely check the workshop if you are on PC because people put a lot of them in there. Uh, let's see. Do I have a video on catching a white moose? Yes. Yes, yes. I do have a video. Look up Charles Macro White Moose. I got two of them. The one with the most views, that's the... That's the earlier one. That's probably the one you should use if you just starting to go there. The one with less views was after I had went and kind of figured out and got some new lures and, and expanded them or upgraded them. So, yeah, do the one with the most views first. It'll be like a slightly older date. But it'll show you how to catch trout, which, again, you mainly need a narrow – I mean, not a narrow. You need a uh, medium spoon. There's this red medium spoon. In fact, I can show you after I bring in this big fish. This might be another yoni. This might be another yoni. We got three yonis. And one I doggone mistakenly let go. But yeah, you check out that video on White Moose. It, uh, it'll show you what you need. Oh yeah, this one's definitely a yoni. Oh, this one's definitely a yoni. He might be over that 40. This one might be a 50 or 60 pounder out there swimming like Jaws. Okay. Well, yeah, yeah. With console, you're going to kind of be limited, of course, because you don't got all the modders who um, put out every type of car possible. You probably seen video where somebody did the Scooby-Doo van. It's really just a, a, a livery. But, yeah, they did the Scooby-Doo van. They got some alternate, like, uh, Lambos. It's a Lambo in the game. But, you know, people do those different years, different models. Let's see what else. I'm trying to think what else I've seen. But, yeah, it's quite a bit in the shop, uh, in the workshop. This one coming in, guys. This one is a uni. This got to be a uni. Yeah, he just swimming like la di da di da Like, what? It's a hook in my mouth. What? What you talking about? Man, if you don't come on in. 
Woo! Okay, 45. All right, guys, we're not going to mess up on this one. All right, so we release a net. Bam. Bam. There we go. Hey, it looked like my total went down. Did I miss something? Let me go look at my keep net. Look at my keep net. Nah, they go both the unis. Okay. That was weird. That was weird. Yeah, I got it back. Look, got them back. Got them back. Oh, no, that's right, because I was at like 170. Now I'm at 190. I was thinking I was at 200 already, but no, nah, I wasn't. Yeah, look, it came back around. You know, it would have been three, so they got a little more, but that's all right. It came back around. I'm actually really pleased. Again, I'm not winning. You know, I'm not top five or whatever, but I'm really pleased because this is my first carp tournament. Just started fishing carp this week. Did Not using one of the spy ride things that I do need to use that I'm going to practice for Actuba. But um, just to have caught this many because it's, Tiber, I literally caught two fish, two carp, and they both was young. They weren't even trophies. So to have caught this many and actually put up a, you know, a fair amount of weight, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Come on, come on. I'm trying to get your cousin, too. I'm trying to get you and your cousin. In fact, I think I'm going to set this hook real quick. Ah. Ah. Let me just set the hook. Let me just set the hook. Let me see. Okay, nah, that one ain't too heavy. We're going to go in and get this one in. Come on in, man. Oh, you heavy. Come on in. And I want to get the one on my carp ride. This might be another trophy, actually. Is this another trophy? Yes. Now, now I'm releasing trophies. Okay, we're going to release that one and keep that one. That one weighed a little more. And let's go after this one on the carp ride. Ah, I lost the one on the carp ride. Dog on it. Doggone it. Yeah, the people at the top, they got to have unis. Because the unis about 40. And they got 500. So that would be 50, 50 per average if they got all 10 50s. But it was like one of them 60. Then they probably got a 40 or two in there. They might have got another 60 or so in there. But yeah, that's that's the average. Let's see if you wanted to play this game uh, like you were a fishing version of Big Trophy Hunter. How would I go about that? I put it in the wrong slot. Dog on it. Get this one back out here. Yeah, they got 10 unis. I don't know. I got to think about how to answer that. I got to think about how to answer that. Mm. But mainly targeting the biggest fish at the biggest lakes. Being strategic. What's up, Braxton? What's going on? What's going on? Let's see. Do I prefer this version of the game or the one that you have to buy? Oh, this one definitely. Um. Well, you know what? Let me Let me clarify the free version they're constantly updating um the free version yeah this version they're constantly updating 
you get all kind of new lakes, all of the new gear, tackle, whatever, whatever that drops. On the the one that you pay, I'm not sure what they were thinking when they made it, what their what their their end game was, but they're not supporting it like they supporting this one. Um yeah, just like OG say, they don't have Amazon there. Like, they haven't even added stuff that's been in this game for months. So they're updating it when they feel like it, and they almost done stopped supporting it. Like, I think they said they're not even going to keep supporting it. So the good part about the game, the bad part is the devs aren't supporting it. They're not going to keep making new stuff for it. You don't even know if you're going to get the lakes that drop on this, even if it's months after, right? If you knew it was coming, it's like, okay, cool. But you won't even know that for sure. Um, so I'm tripping on my my weight. Something up with the weight in my in my in my keep net, but whatever. Um, the other thing is, or the good points is, even though they're not supporting everything, they did put everything that was in this game at that time there. And whenever you catch unis, you get bait coins. You don't get bait coins on here for that. You only get bait coins for your daily logins. And you only get bait coins for uh, missions and tournaments, competitions. But you don't just get them for catching unis, which I think they should be. That's that's actually a really dope idea or dope uh, feature. You get bait coins. You can unlock all the lakes easier. You make more money. That game is almost like you got premium. The whole game. You make more money. You make more XP. You get bait coins for catching uniques. And you can unlock all the lakes and the licenses like way quicker, way easier. So it's still this game at its core. And, you know, if you wanted to play it and really be able to go to all the lakes, not stress, not sweat, grinding out lakes. If you don't have premium and stuff like that, just to go to other lakes to, to upgrade, you can do all of that in that game. You just, again, may not get some of these top lakes that they continue to drop later. That's pretty much the only downside. Cal, what up, what up? Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. You are elite. Hey, what's up, Ed? How you doing? How you doing? What's going on? What's going on? Uh, it's supposed to be Fishing Planet. It's supposed to be Fishing Planet. They was beta testing it. Then the fisherman was going to be an end project, but Fishing Planet is racking in more with the free one. Yeah, they making a t way more money with the free one. Uh, plus DLC. Yeah, yeah, they making a ton more money. Uh, that's definitely why they stick with this one. Yeah, microtransaction, man, they make millions. They act like they ain't making just games, generally speaking. They act like they ain't making a ton of money, man. They making a ton of money. They making a killer. Thousands, millions off this game. Uh, let's see. The only cool thing about the fisherman is you control rides. Yeah, yeah, that's another thing. Besides what I said about like the money and uh, and getting to the lakes, you can actually troll. You can set a ride up on your boat. You can't do that on this one for some reason. Again, as much money as people spend, as much money as they making, you can't troll. You can't ride with friends. You can't put the ride stand up on your boat. Uh, you bought the paid one, and it just doesn't seem the same as the free one. Okay. Yeah, and again, I've never played it. I got it, Braxton, but I never played it. So that's good to know. Say so it just don't feel like the free one. Yeah, this the one they, they just put more time, effort, um, and, and care into, should we say. Carter, what's up, Carters? Let's see, you've been waiting for two years to find someone that strains this game. Wow, really? Well, hey, glad you found us, man. Glad you found me. Glad you found us. Yeah, I do this pretty regularly. Uh, every couple of days, uh, try to stream. Unless something comes up, you know. So, yeah, man, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you enjoy. Yeah, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I can't complain. I cannot complain. It's been a long day. Got up very early. You know, got some work done. Getting some gaming done. Had two streams. Been very productive. Uh, you say Fishing Planet makes an average on the low 1K. Uh, so you know it's at least 100. 
Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, you spent at least a hundred of it yourself. Yeah. No, man, they're making a ton of money. A ton of money. They make they're printing money off this game. And so they definitely could give us a little more. I get it as free to play. I'm cool with that. And because it's free to play, they got to keep these servers going. I understand that. I understand that. I even recommend for some people who just feel like they don't want to spend no money. If you buy games every year, um, if you buy at least one or two games, it might be worth it to buy a pack, you know, a five dollar pack, ten dollar pack, just to support this game, to support the cost of the servers, because they don't charge us anything for the game. And I be thinking, like, I had to really think about it, cause I'm a I'm a free play it, I'm a grinder. I grind from nothing. I grind it all the way to about level forty five or something, uh, before I even did the Amazon, cause that's just that's just how I am with games. But I have been playing this game and enjoying it for a while. So, you know, it does cost to maintain. And if I would buy other $60 games, $50 games, you know, throwing $5, 10 at this game every year really isn't a bad thing, even if it was a little more. Let's see. Let's see. Kyle, thanks. Appreciate that. Are uh, you grinding a white moose right now? Pike's got you 100 k Nice. Nice. Yeah, I usually do the trout because the trout are quicker, but but uh, pike is the better money. You make some real good money on them pike. Oh, and I found a spot where I caught a pike uh, trophy. There's a challenge where you got to catch a pike on a... It's a certain type of jig. It's a certain type of jig. I finished that the other day, though. I found a good pike spot besides the one that's right beside that little cut over there by the tree. It's another one on the side. I'm going to show y'all that. I'm going to show y'all that. I got to get that little video up to show you. Oh, 1K earning in a week. Oh, yes, yes. No, you right. They, yeah, they making that easy. They making that easy. They might be doing 10K a week, if not more. Shit, they might be doing 100. You think now it's on consoles too? It used to just be on PC. Now with it on consoles. I see how much people spend on like 2K opening packs and stuff like that. So I can only imagine how much people spend on here bait coins, um, uh, DLCs, lakes. Like they're making good money. They're making good money. That's the point. Uh, let's see. Hook 10 Ot. Okay. Uh, the most expensive pack not only is less than the price of most new games, but if you get Amazon, like you said, you go from level one to 64 in three days. Absolutely. Absolutely, man. That Amazon, that Amazon is is the best value. If nothing else ain't worth it, that Amazon pack is. Because even if you do the rainforest or the couple of the other joints, they not 30 days. You only got seven days at the lake. That Amazon, you got 30 days at the lake, 30 days premium. You get a 88-pound a ride spin or casting. You get a... You just get so much for that change. Well, other ones, you spend a similar amount, and you don't get, you get like a fraction of that. It might be a decent fraction, but it's a fraction of that. Uh, let's see, you only level 30. Uh, you haven't gotten any heavy bottom ride yet. Uh, so you don't go after the lake trout. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Now, that's smart. That's smart. Um. You can go after trout. I'm going to tell you, you need to get like a 20-pound rod. Like I got this 20-pound bait casters yellow. I fished that white moose with that one for the longest. And I would catch 40-pound uniques with it. Now, they would flip over my kayak. You know, they would take forever to reel in, like 5, 10 minutes. But, but you can, you know, you'll make good money. You'll upgrade. I'm um, in the whole nine, but Pike are the better money though. Yeah, Pike are definitely the better money. Oh, hold on, I was I was getting uh, distracted. You can catch lake trout if you get that twenty pound setup. That twenty pound, it's like twenty to it's twenty four, something like eighteen or twenty four, and then you get you a reel that's closer to that uh twenty four, like twenty three, twenty two. And man, you're real in those uniques. You're really those unique trouts. 
Now your net needs to be at least 40, really over 45. I would say 50 because you're going to catch those uniques and you ain't going to be able to get the money for it. And it's like two Gs. I've done that multiple times when I was still there before I upgraded my keep net. Let's see the OG. You dropped like 300, 400 in the past four weeks on DLCs and giving away like four Amazon DLCs to friends. Hey, that's what's up. Now, I feel you on that. I feel you on that. Again, it's it's worth it. It's worth it. It's definitely worth it. Uh, Say so you need that Amazon pack. Yeah, whenever you able to get it, yo, that Amazon pack is serious. Those bull sharks, if you catch a trophy bull shark, now your net ain't going to be able, if you get the default net they give you, it ain't going to be enough to hold it. But that thing was like, 45,000 or something like that. I think I got 25,000 XP. I wasn't able to keep the money, but I was able to keep the XP. But regular bull sharks are like 24. Yeah, the regular ones are 24. You earn 24K credits. And then you earn a good amount of XP, maybe like 1,000 or so. The young bulls still make you like 8K, which is good money. And then you still get a decent amount of uh, XP as well. Um, let's see. You have that yellow ride. Okay. Your net is 440. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should be good. You should be good. So you don't want to pay the Amazon by yourself. So you was like, why not? Yeah, if you got a, uh, that yellow ride uh, with the yeah, that size keep net, yeah, you can try for some trout. Use the medium spoon, that red medium spoon, and see what you catch. You may just have to turn your drag down a little bit. Turn your drag down and then bring it up after you get a you know a hook or two, a fish or two that bites, and you know, just set it off that fish, and then you'll be good even with the big ones. You know, just you might start with a 41 on your first cast. So yeah, make sure you turn that down. Let's see, if they had DLC with old school spearfishing, would any of y'all buy it? <laughs> hmm. Old school spearfishing. Look, that's kind of dope. You actually spearfishing green hell. I might buy it if you could do that in here. You do know that deep sea fishing is supposed to be coming, so that's going to be like, you know, shooting fish in a barrel. Pun kind of intended. Let's see. Another thing people don't know is if you get stuff from DLCs that you don't want to use, like extra nets, boats, you can sell them and get bait coins back uh, for more than you spent on the pack. I always forget that. I have gotten a few things, or even from that pack, you get a ride, you get a really good keep net. That's what I'm going to have to do when I buy some of those other ones because you get keep nets, and I probably wouldn't use them because I already got a big keep net. All right, let's see, let's see. But yeah, I got to remember to do that. Things that are Bitcoin valuable, you can sell them and get Bitcoins. I'll be forgetting all about that. How much do you get for some of those items, though? Is it like 10, 20? Is it 100? How many Bitcoins would you get if you sold like the boat, for instance? Or the ride that comes from Amazonia? Or um, them swim bait lures? I wonder how much bait coin you would actually receive. <laughs> Spear fishing. I like that idea. Spear fishing, that'd be crazy. So you're going to try that in a little bit. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let's see. If they don't allow us in fishing planet to troll when the oceans come, it'll be a little sad. Yeah. Yeah, that'll definitely mean they're trying to get money at you. So they're inconveniencing you on purpose. And I don't like that. I don't like that. I do love this game and the knowledge that it's the best, you know, fishing out. But if they treat people like that, you know, and I would prefer the next uh, fishing game to come out. I would try to, you know, if a good one comes out, try to rock with that. Because, yeah, they got features that they got to have purposely taken out. Um, like trolling. 
If you control in that game, you should be able to do it in this one. This one is the the core where they made that game from. So that that don't make sense to me. Uh, okay. For example, the boat is around five hundred. Oh wow, wow! I didn't know that. Nets are around one fifty. Yo, I could take some of that money and unlock some other lakes like St. Croix. I think St. Croix like 600. 600. Let's see. Here they use a bow to catch fish. Never done it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no, I hadn't heard of that. Using a bow. Now, I got this game, Medieval Dynasty. You can uh, you shoot the fish with your bow. And then they actually got a spear, kind of trident-ish for going after them uh, like that. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, you usually the bow is for carp uh, that are invasive and use lights to make them jump. Okay. In the DLC, you can have different spears. Uh, types of wood upgrades to metal tips. Nice. It's all about the dollar tag. Dollar bill, y'all. Dollar bill, y'all. Dollar, 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 dollar bill, y'all. All right, come on in. You're not another uh, uni. You might be a trophy, but nah, I think you're just a regular common. Yep, just a regular, regular schmegler. Oh, I see what's wrong. So they're not counting these towards my total. Ah, I would get the money. I actually, I was wondering what that was about. Okay. So learning something else, guys. Ah, uh, and that one unique I caught don't count. Ooh, that second one. Okay, okay, learning something new. So you got to catch all of these on the carp rides. So I actually will have more in my total, and I ain't even know it. So even though it's keeping them, and like I would have got the money for them at the end and selling them, like, I'm not going to dump this unique out until I get another unique. But, yeah, they aren't counting these. They only counting the ones that I catch with my carp rides. Ain't that a blip? And I've caught more with my carp rides, but I thought that they uh, I thought they counted all of them. So I've actually released some that I caught with my carp ride. I was sitting there like, did my total go down? I thought I was tripping. I thought I was tripping, but I was not. I was not. That's cool, though. I ain't tripping. You live and learn. I wasn't going to be top uh, five, per se. But at least I'm learning, and y'all will know, too. You can still add fish to your net, but if you don't do what the rules say, you're not going to, like, they're not going to apply uh, to your your total of fish. Uh, let's see, you heard through the grapevine, the next map might be an Asian waterway. But, man, if they don't start making oceans soon, how much bigger do these river monsters get? Yeah, I know, right? Like, what's the next monster going to be besides a shark? You know, it's going to be a dragon? We're going to be catching alligators? Like, what they going to do, you know? Um, I actually heard that they were going to be doing deep sea fishing. Um, Like, we would do deep... I really don't know how they would implement that. And I really wonder how that would affect the game. And then would they add things like trolling and all of that and enable stuff? Would they enable people uh, being able to get on the ship together? Would this be some like game changing update? Say they did deep sea fishing where multiple people could be on the deep sea uh, boat together and fish. Cause usually people don't deep sea fish solo, you know, unless you like live on the ocean and that's what you do. Most people, if they deep sea fish, they're going to, um, they usually gonna have people with them, or you charter a boat so that people can, you know, split that fuel cost. So I think that's gonna be interesting to see. Uh, that's what I thought, but you didn't want to say nothing with the bottom rides. Yeah, hey, let me know, man. That's why I look. 
That's why we are here. So let me know if you see something. We do this in the strands all the time, man. I let I I, I enjoy it. Everybody helps and give input. So yeah, cause that would have saved me some um some fish that I missed. Had I known earlier, I would have stopped doing that. But you know, again, you live and learn, you figure it out. So I ain't tripping. But yeah, yo yo input, yo tips, you know. Tips, info, is always appreciated here. Oh, okay, just in case you was wrong. I feel you, I feel you. Yeah, say oceans uh, would be cool. Yeah, I agree. But again, the Asian waterways would be cool too because, again, I'm wondering as well, how many other lakes can they add? Will they add? Will they keep going? You know, will we get 10, 20 more? All right, come on. Let me get a good one on here. Let me get a good one. Uh, let's see. Yesterday for Tibber, there was a small issue with multiple people trying to enter uh, with PVA mesh bags and could. Some had to take the bags off and leave them there in the inventory to go to the lake. Uh, others couldn't even enter. So you thought people didn't read the rules, right? But come to find out it was able to work today, luckily. Okay, well, good that it was able to work because that'd be jacked up if you couldn't do it. Um, you also didn't want to say nothing because uh, no warning ever popped up. And I know that's why I thought I could do it because I feel like the when I first fished, I caught one and it wouldn't let me, like it wouldn't even let me put it in there or something. I caught a, I threw these, carp rise in and I threw one of those in and I caught one and it was like it wouldn't let me or it let me know that it wasn't one that would be acceptable for the tournament so I was like okay I can't do it but then it started letting me put them in so I said okay maybe I was wrong alright cool 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 that's alright we got a trophy we got a trophy let's keep that there we go getting our total back up we gonna get it over 200 we going to get over 200. We got 12 minutes left, guys. 12 minutes left, and we going to wrap. We going to wrap. 12 minutes left. Uh, Let's see. The next location is a river in Bolivia. Okay, nice, nice. I can't wait to see that. Uh, How many monster fish you already catch? I've actually caught quite a few. Um, I done caught most of the monsters. Uh, I'm gonna put this ride down. I'll show you. Uh, let's see. And what's up, Kim? How you doing? Uh, they could do charters easy enough, which would be cool. Yeah, that would be dope. Hey, what's up, Bonzo? What's going on? Pier fishing or boat charter? Mm, pier fishing or boat charter? Okay, I've done both. I'm gonna tell you, I like chartering just because you catch more fish. Um, the last deep sea fishing, uh, boat that I went on, I caught a shark. I caught like a bunch of red snapper, croaker, uh, uh, flounder, man. Flounder is an ugly fish. That is an ugly fish. Um, it looked weird. Uh, what else I caught? Uh, somebody on the boat called a, it was either barracuda or a mahi mahi. It was huge, and the thing, they had to drag it around the boat. We ain't have, but, like, this much space between the rail that we fishing off of and the cabin part that you could go in. So it was, people had to, like, literally scooch around each other. You know what I mean? And somebody caught this, like, six to ten foot barracuda looking thing. Man, that fish was going crazy. They had it on the hook dragging it. And it was wild. Like, ah, ah, ah. like, I had to jump up on the rail. Like, everybody was getting their feet up, <laughs> about to fall off the boat, trying to get away from that barracuda. Like, that thing was crazy. Teeth was like this big, like, big as my fingers. Like, man, that thing was crazy. Um, Okay, the monsters. Let me show you the monsters real quick. These are all the monsters that I have caught. These are all the monsters. Lone Star, Lesney, Mudwater, Rocky, Emerald, and the Heron. We were just doing them on the stream. I caught like all these on the stream. Sometimes I would catch two, two per uh stream. Falcon, Everglades, White Moose, Quanchkin, St. Croix, Kanique. Yeah, all that, all that. 
The only ones, okay, I caught Lesney. That one in Gent or Gent, the Eels, man, that's the worst. I don't even know if I'm going to catch that one. Oh, me and my guy Jay. Jay actually went at that more than I did. You only get five Eels. You got to catch five Eels, and then you get five Eels. And when you get those Eels, it take like an hour. Like, they don't bite. It bite less than carp. So you might sit there and only catch one eel like every 10 or 15 minutes. It took like two, three hours to catch all five. Then you throw it out there for that for that uh monster eel, and it never bites it. And your, your bait just get eaten up by the other fish. You only got five of them. They didn't give you 15 like they do the other one. They only give you five. This must have been something they did early when the game first came out with the first monsters because I can't see why they would only give you five bait. So, yeah, they all get eaten up. He did it about five, six times. Because then you got to go back, catch five more eels, which take you two, three hours. Do it again. Catch five more every time you run out, man. I know he did that about ten times. I don't even know if he caught the monster yet. I got to check with him. Oh, you think Bolivia's a thing already? 58 to 63. Oh, Marion. Okay, I thought that sounded familiar. Amazon is after Bolivia. Okay. Uh, if you go to Fisher Planet Forum and go to the Dev Diaries, you can check out the new location along with the new fish species. Ah, okay, Dev Diaries, go to the forum. Okay, okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. Should I might do a little update video on that? Uh, let's see, Amazon, that's Bolivia. Brock, ah, man, I struck. I was getting a hit and I didn't even know it. I just wanted to recast. What up, Brock? What's going on, man? Hey, man, appreciate you coming through, man. Look, I understand. I understand. You probably what? Getting up, getting ready for work or something? It's about 6 o'clock in the morning. Where you at? Hey, man. How you been, man? I ain't seen you in a minute. How you been, man? How you been? Hope all has been well with you. Flounder is good eating. Yeah, that's one of my favorite fish to eat. That's one of my favorite fish to eat. I love flounder. Give me some flounder and scrimps. Fried flounder and scrimps. With some tartar sauce. Call it a day. I feel like I ate that like yesterday. We eat that quite a bit. And then if you want to get healthy, you know, go on and bake it or uh, uh, get you some scampi or something like that. Get your little butter, lemon drizzling on there, salt and pepper. Some other seasonings, garlic if you into it. Man, you about to make me go jump in the kitchen and cook some. Uh, let's see, you had to reopen the game to check. Uh, you're bad on late comment. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. No worries. Oh, it's 1.44 p.m. Okay. Okay, it's the afternoon. All right, you know, I still be trying to figure out our time zones, man. You know we on two opposite sides of the world. That's what's up, man. Glad to hear that. Glad to hear that. Glad all has been well. Hey, what's up, Anthony? What's up? Oh, you say thanks again for streaming. Hey, absolutely, man. I I'm really glad y'all wanted to do it because um, I would have been playing this anyway. I just would have been sitting here myself. So um, when y'all said y'all wanted me to go ahead and stream it, I like, that's what's up. You know, and I ain't want to, you know how this carp joint is. I ain't want to be boring. But um, we got some good catches. Um, I hope that, you know, if you were interested in doing this tournament or just tournaments in general, or even carp fishing, like you was able to learn something from this here. Um, because again, I learned that you gotta kit. I thought so, but then I thought that the rule wasn't applying here, but you gotta use carp rides, you know. Um, just seeing the protocol, the way things work. I'm gonna get in the tournament next month. I probably do this every month now, again, because I got enough, you know, change that I could do it into the tournaments and just see how I do, you know. Unless it's just one that I really don't want to fool with. But yeah, man, I'm glad y'all was here to rock with me. And, um, you know, you're welcome. Uh, just for, for the thank you, you're welcome. But, man, thank you as well for being here and, and being a part of this with me, man. Oh, what time is it for me? It is 11.45 p.m. It's almost midnight in 15 minutes. That's why I'm going to wrap it up. I'll be trying to be done by about 11. 
And I use I sit up late and stuff, but I've been trying to get to bed earlier so I can get up earlier in the morning. Again, now that I got a young son, it's like it it be affecting my schedule. You know, I used to be able to be up late game and this and that, but now I be trying to get to bed a little earlier so I can just get up at like five in the morning, you know. Go hard all day and do some extra work before everybody get up. All right, let's see, let's see. Why would I want to release any of those? Uh, Let's see, we keep that 10 pound. Okay, we got over 200. I mean, that was one of my goals. I just wanted to get over 200 pounds. I really did it a long time ago, but I was releasing competition fish and didn't realize it because I was catching non-competition fish with my other rods. I'm going to probably invest in a third rod. I'm going to go back to White Moose and um, stack up about 100K. These carp rides are expensive. These carp setups, it's like 70K for the ride, like 40K for the reel. Then you got to get the line, the leader, the um, the weight. These carp rides, they're not cheap. They're not cheap, but they do work well when you're going at the carp. Uh, let's see. Uh, they really got to add ride stands on boats for trolling. Absolutely. I agree, Ben. I agree. Catfish with tartar sauce and fries. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. It's just a little late, but it's all good. Uh, let's see. You getting in the gar tourney. You don't know if you are. The rule's pretty rough. One float. Ride only. No ride stand. No boat. Woo. Yeah, that is kind of rough. I'm going to think about that. I'm going to have to practice catching gar like that. Because even when you know the spots, they don't work. So I don't want to get in there and just be sitting there not catching nothing. And if it be two hours, yeah, I don't know about that. I think about it. Let's see. Anthony, you tried the Mighty Carp. You got 121st out of 500. Nice, nice. Yeah, I'm 174. I would have been a, a little uh, further up, but I was keeping fish that don't apply, and I didn't realize it. So I actually might have released. I think I released a trophy which would have gave me 20 more pounds. Um, I caught a uni, but it was on a ride that doesn't count. It was a nine-carp ride, so that's 40 pounds that ain't applied right there. I think I probably would have got close to 300 had I known. Again, still not in the top, but that three might have got me closer to 100. But uh, no worries, no worries. Let's see, catfish and spaghetti. I ain't never done that. Now, I do ride with spaghetti and catfish, but I ain't never ate them together. That's interesting. Uh, let's see. Hey, you like to fish with me? Yeah, that's what's up. But one day in real life, man, one day I hope that if the channel grows to the point, you know how like uh content creators, you know, they do like meetups and stuff like that. One day I'm gonna have like a big fishing meetup, like a big fishing tournament, or even if it ain't a tournament, like everybody just go to some lake and fish, or just tour all around the country, you know. Hit different at yeah, the world, cause we all in different parts of the world. We ain't even just different parts of the country. But like that would be dope if uh, we could all fish together. I'm level 53. By the time this end, I might get close to 54. I'm trying to get to 54 because it unlock uh blue crab, I believe. And they say some good money in blue crab. So I'm trying to get there. I believe that's 54. Let's see, Anthony. You did round two today. You got to wait till everyone finishes to see where you placed. Uh, you don't think you'll make the tournament? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know either. Um, again, this was my first time. I just started fishing carp like last week. Really this week, basically, with Weeping Willow. When I did Weeping Willow Strange last week, just really started um, fishing these. So I just jumped in like blind, like forget it. I'm going to just go for it, you know? Hey, we're going to end with a uni, guys. This is a uni. If I can get it in, I only got 51 seconds. Yeah, this look like uni status, guys. He's swimming like he a shark. I mean, it could be a trophy because I am getting them in. It usually take a little longer. This is either a big trophy or a uni. Let's see how we end it. Let's see how we end it. Okay, a big trophy. That's all right. That's all right. You see, like, I got this unique right here, 45 pounds that don't count. And I had another uh, trophy or two that I let go that I ain't realized. All right, so let's release this one. Let's keep this one. 
that other uni that didn't count, it'll at least count towards the money that I take home because I had to release everything else. All these fish we caught, we released them so we don't get no money. Two, one, and there we go. There we go. There we go. 231, 46 was the biggest one. All fish caught. But I got to learn to use that spot. I got to learn to use that spot. Not bad, guys. Not bad. We made 12,000. Not bad. 10 fish, 12,000. That ain't bad at all. If all them joints would have counted, sure, we might have made 20. But, um, yeah, I'm going to show you real quick. I got this spot right here. This spot, this trophy extra large, long cast spot. I was gonna use it here to see if it worked, but I wanted to go ahead and get started. And I ain't never tested it. And I did make a. Uh, I got a nice recipe for this ground bait. I need to name it. Let's see. Can you name it? Uh, what are we gonna call this? Uh, carp. That carp flavor. All right, number one. That's my first recipe I saved, so it should bring this right back. But this is supposed to work really well at Weeping Willow, and it's supposed to work really well if you put it in that spot, in this long casting spot. So, yeah, we're going to get this. Uh, we're going to try this out. I'm going to go practice at Arctuba. I've never been there. So, yeah, I'm going to go there. And uh, I'm also going to white moose probably tomorrow and do some little competitions to make some of my money back and to make them bait coins. Remember, guys, remember, if you're trying to make bait coins, you know bait coins are rare. If you're not good at doing missions and if you like if you ain't winning tournaments or competitions, look for these group competitions. Let me go to tomorrow, see if anybody ready. Nah, they ain't posted yet. Look for competitions where it's teams. Team competitions, if they go like this, you can win uh, bait coins. I've won about 30, 40, maybe 50 bait coins in the last week just doing team competitions because even if you are not good, your team might win. I lost a, 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 I lost a custom competition earlier where half of my team didn't show up. My guys was the top guys. But because my team didn't show up, they beat us because they had more numbers. So you might win like that. Some of these be having 5, 10, 20 uh, bait coins as reward. Look at this, 100 bait coins. Now, this ain't a team one, but 150, 20. Yo, you win one of these and you win the game. Otherwise, you only get them on your daily logins and stuff like that. So anyway, that's that, guys. That's that. Uh, let me see. Uh, Blue Crab, Tarpon. I'm a, let, me, let me check the last comments. You got four cart rides. It costs you 350K. Woo. Yeah, man. These cart rides ain't cheap. Let's see. You can buy the cart pack for five bucks. It gives you Sport Deep Horizon, a uh, real chamber to buy that way within the game credits. Okay. Okay. I have to look into it. I'm going to try to get, I'm going to try to get me two more. I'm going to try to get it to, uh, get it out the mud. Skull Rush, Mississippi thing. Hey. Let's see. Blue Crab. Tarpon is decent and the unis are decent. Okay, okay. Yeah, I got to know what to target because I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure if it was carp or what. Anthony, you said you had Weeping Willows trying to make more money to buy another uh, La Cosadora ride. You only have one. Would like to have two before you had the Blue Crab. Yeah, I only had one. I was fishing with one, but as long as you got bottom rides, you can use those bottom rides there too. You just can't do what I did with the uh, with the PVAs and stuff. You know, that got to be a carp ride. But, yeah. And then if you get this spy ride, man, do this mission. If you hadn't done it already, you might have already done it. Do this mastering mission. Trophy carp. Hit these three. Tiber, Sander, Weeping. Win this and you can use this. I've seen where if you use this spy casing thing and you throw a bunch of a uh, bunch of these joints out there, man, you can catch like 10, 20 unis back to back to back. The uni rule is broken when you use that spot or use these bait. Maybe it's these and the spot because I caught a couple unis. But, yo, you can catch unis back to back to back, like making a quick 30, 40K. 
Uh, okay. Let's see. You should come to Australia and fish. Uh, you sorry to the Americans, but you think your fishing is better. <laughs> I mean, you know, you got to support your, 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 where you're from, man. You got to rep your, your country, rep your continent. But, uh, yeah, we're going to put that to the test, man. I'm coming to Australia, and we're going to fish. I want to see if the fishing is truly better or if it's better in the States. All right? You're going to have to come to the States. Yeah. Werewolf. You say three? Wolf, what you saying about three? I probably asked something or said something, and you was responding to that. Uh, let's see. Tournaments are so hard. It's not that we stink. Uh, they make it so hard, so don't beat yourself. Hey, yeah, no, I feel you. I feel you. I'm good. Just the fact that y'all was here to rocking with me, man, I'm good. I'm good. I'm going to win one one day or at least place. At least place. Because, man, what you win. Look at these prizes, though. Look at these prizes, guys. 200,000 credits, 5,000 bait coins. That's what I want, the bait coins. 5,000 bait coins, 3,000 bait coins, 1,000. The credits, we can earn these credits. We know how to get these, but these bait coins, you know how many lakes you can unlock with these? 5,000 bait coins? Uh, 2,000 bait coins is what, $100? 5,000 bait coins, that's basically like $250 worth of bait coins. You know how much stuff you can unlock? You can unlock... uh. The Amazon with this. You can unlock Amazon and like two or three more lakes with whatever's left. Two or three big lakes or like all of the lower lakes. Uh, the X-Series, Power Boat. You know, that's good too to add that. Max Drag 42. But yeah, this is what you want. This is what you want. All right. Uh, let's see. Before you go, uh, next Fishing Planet stream time and day uh i don't know the time i really can't say a definite time but um i plan to stream tomorrow i might stream during the day um i, I usually work i got some work and stuff to do and i usually have a meeting so after my meeting sometimes it's like 12 p.m uh 1 p.m like est and then if i stream the second time it'll be at night like tonight it'll be probably the same time like 9 p.m if i stream in the evening um, it's usually later around nine, um, unless my, you know, my son is good or something like that. And but usually I gotta just wait. I put him to bed or he's sleep. So yeah, it, it might be nine ish. It could be around noon ish if I do an early stream. Go on and subscribe if you are not subscribed. Hit that like button, guys. If y'all still here, hit that like button for me. Subscribe and you can get the notification when we go live, all right? Or if you're in the Discord, I drop it in the Discord. Be trying to, uh, you know, at least let you know if you happen to see it. Uh, but, yeah, yeah, that's about it, guys. That's about it. Tomorrow's going to be rough at Russia. You know that for a fact. Yeah, yeah. Uh, same here. Because that's what this is, right? October, yeah. This is going to be crazy. It starts at 2 p.m., so uh, I'm going to practice in the morning. We maybe will practice on the stream. I don't know. But I'm going to practice, find the spots, because I've never been here to find the spots. Get me a few spots and get ready for the doggone uh, tournament. OG, yo, appreciate that follow, OG. You elite. You are elite. Yeah, man. It's going to be crazy. Uh, so you have a good evening. I ain't read your comment, Brock. Here. You talking about, about the fishing in Australia? Man, I said a whole spiel about that, Brock. I said a whole spiel that we I'm coming to Australia, we going to fish, and we going to put that to the test, or you going to have to come here to the States. But, yeah, we going to put that to the test, and, yeah, we going to get our fish on, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, tomorrow will be streaming. Let's uh, see. That's the trophy spot. Yeah, that's the trophy spot. It holds two kinds of feed. Yeah, you put two of them balls in there, and then you throw them out. You throw it out about 10, 15 times, and it's basically feeding the area so the carp just come. They just come, and they sit in there. You'll catch a bunch of unis, and the uni rule that you can only catch one a day is broken. You can catch like 10 of them. It's crazy. Uh, let's see. You think you hit it by accident, but blue crab is nice. That's what's up. 
Uh, all you catch is bass. <laughs> Some good fish. Let's see. That trophy spot is the bomb. Yeah, I'm I'm going to practice tomorrow with it. I'm going to practice with it and see if I can find the spots at uh, in Russia. Let's see. Be here tomorrow. Make sure leaders. Okay. At least in my luck. Ah, oh, man, I can't read with the typos. Uh, Make sure the leaders are... Okay, I try to do that. I ain't sure what they say, OG. Type that again, OG. Make sure the leaders are what? I think somebody was telling me that carp react better to mono leaders and fluoro leaders and not the, uh, the titaniums. I still got my titaniums on, though, I believe, but... Oh, these carp leaders anyway, so... It don't even matter. I got carp leaders on here. On these, oh, yeah, I still got the titaniums on my feeders, though. Uh, that's all right. That's all right. Okay. The leaders are short. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That's what's up. All right, guys. Well, look, man. We're going to wrap it up. We're going to do it tomorrow. Same bat time, same bat channel. Uh, again, potentially may do a, a early afternoon one here, EST, noonish. And one at uh, 9 p.m. ish, you know, in the evening, man. So just be on the lookout. Y'all holla at me if you're in the Discord. Thank you to everybody who's supporting. Thank you to my elite fam. Thank you to everybody who's a member who's supporting that way. Thank you to my Patreons. Thank you to everybody who does Super Chat. And then thank you to everybody who's just here supporting, liking, subscribing, sharing, uh, feeding that YouTube algorithm, man, so we growing, man. We've been growing, and it's been great. And uh, thank you to everybody who has also been supporting in the discord and again um thank you to everybody who was helping to you keep me uplifted i mean it's it's still it's something that is still fresh but you know my soldier through it just like my cuz you know um and um you know things happen man in life and it's crazy but again we we keep fighting and we keep soldiering through it man even when bad things happen with with family and with losses of loved ones and things of that nature which again that's something that um, going through right now, but man, I appreciate all y'all being here and rocking with me, man. It helped to uh, even keep my mind off that type of stuff, man. So thank you. We're gonna get up out of here. Y'all come back and holla at me. And um, I see y'all on the later on. Peace and blessings. Have a great day tomorrow. Uh, hope you and your family are healthy, you know, happy, prosperous, and productive day tomorrow, guys. And I'm gonna get up with y'all. All right. All right. Oh, let me do my sign off. Charles Macro Fishing Planet. Thank you for stopping through, and I'm going to holler at you. Peace. I'll holler at y'all. Y'all take it easy.